Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today it's a lipstick declutter video. I've been waiting so long to do this one, one of these videos. Uh, it's just taking me a while because I wanted to, I don't know, record other videos first, but uh, finally we're here. All right, so we're going down and down. This, So this is the drawer of the lipstick mess that I have. Look at that. It needs to be decluttered. A sap. Um, so if you want to see a declutter video, well, keep on watching. Look at this. Oh my god, so much lipstick. So this box is overwhelming, so I'm gonna split it up. Uh, whatever I'm keeping, I'm gonna put it in this bin, our tray. Let's get started. I know a really easy one for me will be these Maybelline lip, uh, lip glosses. I don't know you ever, I mean, I don't know how popular are they anymore, but these are probably one of the first uh, makeup items I ever bought. So they're pretty special, but I am gonna get rid of them. Yeah, they were really good. Honestly, I really love these glosses, but I don't know why I never really wore them. I'm not, uh, I guess I realized I'm not biggest fan of uh, lip glosses. These are super pigmented. Um, well, not super pigmented, but they were really pigmented. But as I said, I need to be declaring some uh, non-cruelty free stuff. So I'm going to get rid of this. Uh, where should I put them? I guess I'll put them from the side now. <laughs> um, next bin. Let's get this bin. Okay, so this is the next bin. I'm just gonna flip it. Uh, again, this is a lot of products. Oh, I have an eyeliner or lip pencil uh, sharpener, but those like jumbo ones, whatever, this shouldn't be here. Um, Oh my god, I used to love Maybelline, but I, I I think I'm going to get rid of them, of the Maybelline ones. Um, Alright, so first of all, this is a Sephora lipstick. Uh, it's very old, it's tested on animals, so for sure I'm going to get rid of it. Um, this is a Milani. Sangria uh, lipstick. It's really pretty, but it's, be it's very old. So I don't think I am gonna um, use it anymore. I think it even went bad because it smells bad. <laughs> uh, Revlon, this, this was a lip balm. I'm gonna get rid of it also. Not tested on animals for sure. I don't want it. I'm gonna get rid of all this Revlon, honestly. Uh, lip balm things now I have <sighs> this Maybelline lipstick I'm gonna get rid of it this is uh, on Tina Spice uh, I'm gonna get rid of it also oh my god I'm doing way better than I was expecting uh, Touch of Spice I am gonna get rid of it as well now, this one is 107 from uh, Rimmel. Uh, this one is a special one because I remember like one of my first videos. Uh, oh, and if you see these dangle things, those are my, <laughs> from my sweater. I'll try to keep it. Uh, this is special because whenever I was starting to watch uh, YouTube videos, one of the first channels that I watched was Soella. And she would love this one, this lipstick, especially for the fall. So that gives me good memories, but I ne I don't use it. And as I said, it's tested on an animal, so I'm going to get rid of it. Um, Maybelline. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Oh my God, this one is so cute. And it was limited edition. <laughs> Actually, no, it's just not. Ah, uh, whatever. 
whatever. This one is painful. Or orchid ecstasy. Um, I used to like it as a kind of like lip balm. Um, and then I remember I went through several Walgreens to get this one, but honestly, I should be get rid of getting rid of it. Uh, so I will. Now we have left three. All right, this is kind of like on camera. I need to kind of get rid of it a little bit. Ugh. Getting rid of it. All right, now Milani, I am gonna keep it. Look at that one. Oh yes, it's a limited. Uh, it was a limited uh, lipstick, but I still love it. I need to wear them more. I'm kind of excited now that I'm decluttering. Hopefully, I wear more of these uh, lipsticks. So for sure, I'm keeping Milani. It will go on our keep pile. So so far, we have two to keep. Now, this is the ones that I was worrying about that I wasn't gonna be able to declutter. The Tom Ford. These are expensive. So whenever I was looking for colors to buy, I would have to make sure I was going to wear them and they were going to be pretty and they're expensive. Um, I don't think I can get rid of it. Uh, I'm going to wait for my mom to come home or me visiting her or something and I'll bring them and see if she likes it. But if not, I guess I'll just keep them even if I don't wear them or something i just don't see me getting rid of these so i'm sorry if there's any cruelty free police out there or something so i'm it in i want to use this one as a get rid of so so far this has this is what i'm getting rid of Maybelline thing. That's a Maybelline. Happy. I'm gonna get rid of quite a bit. Alright. Uh oh my god. Yeah. And these ones were also the ones that I was worried. Limited editions from MAC Cosmetics. This is a Cinderella one. My husband wait because I, I worked that day, so my husband um stay in line for me in order to get the Max Cinderella collection, so I'm just gonna keep it as a memory. Now, I have these glosses now. I, this is a NARS gloss, which looks pretty old and kind of gross inside. I don't know if you can tell. Gross. So, I'm gonna get rid of it. It looks kind of pretty disgusting, so <laughs> I'm gonna get rid of it. Here is a Chanel gloss. Um. Even though I pay a lot, I cannot keep every single makeup item, right? Um, even if I paid a lot for it. So I'm gonna get rid of it. Now, uh, this Buxom lip gloss. I used to love this color. I just don't like lip glosses too much. It's not that I don't like them. I just don't find myself like using them. So I don't know. But I love this color on my lips. It's like such a beautiful pink. Even it looks purple on the thing. Uh, should we start a maybe pile and see how many I kept or not? So I'm gonna put it on the maybe pile. This is a Anastasia Beverly Hills um, matte or no, but liquid lipstick. This is Craft. Uh, this is the only one that I have from her, so I am gonna keep it. I need to wear it more. So, ah, uh, Revlon. Nope, thank you. Uh, Clinique Chubby Stick. No, thank you. Tested on animals. Um, Bite Beauty. I don't know. I don't use it though. That's pretty, but I'm gonna get rid of it because honestly, I mean, I cannot keep also a bunch of glosses because I, I don't really wear them, so I'm gonna get rid of it. Uh, ah. I have still a patina. This is one was one of my first like liquid lipsticks. Uh, I'm for sure gonna keep it. And it's cruelty free, so kudos. Um, I'm gonna grab all these Revlon and for sure get rid of it. MAC limited edition. I'm just gonna keep it. 
as like collector but um now i have another limited edition this is the simpsons by mac i know i have another one which i don't know where it is but i can, oh it's right here so i have an orange and a purple one i think i'm gonna get rid of um uh, i'm just gonna keep one i think i'm gonna get rid of the purple and i'm gonna keep the orange one Uh, I have this Sharon Osbourne <laughs> um, kind of like lip balms a little bit I'll probably also going to get rid of one of them because I don't need to uh, and I I don't know it's just a chat they bring me good memories but I think I need to get rid of one at least all right, I'm gonna get rid of the red one and I'm gonna keep um, this kind of pinky one. All right, we're doing good. Now we have Tootsie by Colourpop. Um, um, I don't know, I have a feeling that I didn't like this one back in the day, but I'm, I'm kind of changed, so I might like it now. So this will go to the maybe pile. So far I have two in the maybe pile. Now I have uh, the Too Faced Sell Out, that's the name of it, from the Melted Matte. Uh, this is one of my favorite like liquid lipstick formulas, so I'm for sure keeping this one. Um, I absolutely love it. Um, now we have these. I have a uh, Tinted Lip Gloss by Kaylin. I got in one of those like boxes, like that you pay ten dollars and you get something. I don't remember which box though. I never use it, so I'm gonna get rid of it. Now we had this kind of cream sheen lip gloss. This was from a limited edition, so I don't use lip glosses that much. So I wanna get rid of it. Wow, I didn't think I was gonna be that cruel. Like, I'm just gonna get rid of it. Um, this tiny chocolate milkshake, um, melted chocolate lipstick, um, from Too Faced, I am gonna keep it, hopefully now that I, um, got rid of, um, some stuff, I'm gonna use it, but if I don't see that I use it, uh, in a while, I'll probably get rid of it. Now, I have this, um, limited edition, um, lipsticks from, um, Jeffree Star. I am going to keep them. I love them all. Uh, this one has nothing, so... Um, I like keeping the boxes. I know it takes space, so... But I don't... I don't know. I feel bad tossing the uh, boxes, but I think I should be tossing the boxes and just keeping the lipstick. That way I get to see it and possibly wear them one more than I should be doing, so... That, let's go to the keep. All right, let's move on to this. Uh, look at that. This is such a mess. All right, this is kind of overwhelming. I'm wondering if I should put it a little bit in the back. Yeah. All right, I know which one, one that is going to be easy. So this is going to be, I have here lip balms from. Uh, my mom got me these ones. I don't know where she got them from, but um, it's kind of like an oil lip balm. Yes, I put it over red lipstick, so I'm sorry. That might be kind of gross. Uh, I like them, and my mom got them, so I am going to keep it. <sighs> Alright, so this one is going to be an easy one. Lip balms. Uh, this is the Caress lip butter i am gonna keep it it's cruelty free so for sure i need a cruelty free lip balm i'm gonna get rid of this sugar um do i used to like to it, but it's not cruelty free so i'm gonna get rid of it oh never mind it was this one rose i'm gonna get rid of it all right so i i remember also this was one of my first like make like i got into makeup like the baby lips so they kind of 
bring me good memories, I guess. <sighs> but even if they're not cruelty free, I don't even use them. For the purposes that I need lip balm and I'm not gonna buy a new lip balm just because I got rid of some other ones. I'm going to keep this one and this one. And I'm gonna get rid of the rest. Oops. I'm gonna get up. Oh, I'm gonna get rid of all these ones and the one that fell all the way here. I'm gonna get rid of those. And I'm gonna keep these two. I'll finish them and then I'll buy a cruelty free lip balm. Alright, next I had this. <sighs> Deconstructed rose uh, lip glosses from Bite Beauty. I use, I mean, the first time, I mean, look at them, they're beautiful. I don't know why I don't wear them that more often. Oh, actually, one of them that we got rid of uh, belongs here because, like, see, it's missing one, it's moving. I don't know, I never wore them. I want to put it in the maybe file. If I don't keep that many glosses, then I'll keep them, but we'll see. All right, I have an Urban Decay. This is kind of, what is it? I don't remember. Yeah, it's a lip gloss, but those that are kind of pigmented. So I am gonna keep it. I remember I used to love this color and I need to wear it more often. And now that I'm decluttering, I'll probably find it better. A YSL lipstick, or sorry, lip gloss. I used to love the color, but I never used it because of the smell. I hate the smell. And now that I went cruelty free, even less I'm gonna wear it, so. All right, just to make it easy, I'm gonna grab all the Revlon, kind of like, and I'm gonna get rid of them. I have an empty packaging from Jeffree Star, so I'm gonna toss it. All right, let's put all these, now that we're talking about liquid lipsticks. All right. So I have these ones from Jeffree Star. This is uh, Rose Matter, which actually belongs to this kind of like limited edition packaging or from Beautylish. Uh, I don't think it's a bit, limited edition, but it's like specific to Beautylish. I love the packaging, kind of like the tattoos from Jeffrey, but I don't know. We'll see how much lipstick I have and how I rearrange it, but if it doesn't fit, I won't keep it, but I will keep for sure the lipsticks because I like it. Um, I need to find the other one that belongs here. This one is Mannequin. Mannequin, Rose Matter, and I'm missing Gemini, which I don't know where it is, but I'm keeping this set for sure. Uh, I love Jeffree Star lipsticks, uh, or liquid lipsticks, besides the um, Too Faced, and these ones, these one, uh, both of those are my favorite. So I'm gonna keep them. I also love the Jouer ones, so yeah. Between the Jouet, Jeffree Star, and uh, Too Faced, those are my favorite, like, melted uh, or liquid lipstick formula. This one is Dulce de Leche. I wore this color, I think, to my wedding. I love it. Uh, all right, this one, wow. I think this one was actually my first uh, liquid lipstick. It's super old, I love the color, it brings me good memories, but I'm just gonna keep it, either for me to reorder it, to remember me that I need to reorder this exactly one or a better, uh, like another brand, but as long as it matches this color, it's just the perfect red lipstick. So if you have any recommendations that are cruelty free, let me know. I know this one is cruelty free, but I mean, it's really old, so. I need to replace it by something, but I love the, I used to love this color. Oh my God. So I'm just gonna keep it in order for me to remember. Now I had two more, 
lipsticks, which I'm for sure not gonna keep this packaging, this pink one, because that's the usual packaging. So I have I'm Royalty and Scorpio, which I'm gonna keep both. I mean, come on. This one out. There's another one random there. All right, we have a couple. More. Again, I have these lip glosses from MAC. They're limited edition, so I am gonna keep them. Uh, I have On Point. I love this lipstick. And I have the new um, Freshly Baked lips, uh, Liquid Lipstick from uh, Candy Johnson Collection. So I really recommend this one. If it's still in stock, you should, I think, I recommend it. It's a beautiful color. So that's a keeper. All right. We're reaching to the point where I'm about to have the same amount of keepers and getting rid of. So I need to get rid of more because I definitely want to get rid of more than keep. Uh, next, this one is supposed to be matte, but it's not, I have better matte, so that's why I'm gonna get rid of it, even though it's a pretty color and I have nothing bad to say about these ones, but I feel I have better matte, so I'm gonna get rid of it. Uh, I love this color, this one came with the uh, collection with Too Faced that had like her, uh, the, the heart eyeshadow palette, I really like this color. This is XO, so I'm gonna keep that. Another Maybelline, I'm gonna get rid of it. I have this Too Faced uh, Sweet Beach, <laughs> the matte colors. It's new, I got it in like a point reward, so I'm gonna keep it. I had to try it, I haven't even tried it yet. Have this uh, new Charlotte Tilbury. Uh, Kind of like liquid lipstick, but they're kind of, um, they're not as drying as the other ones, but they don't stay as long either. So it's new and I'm gonna keep it. Uh, I have a Revlon, I'm gonna get rid of it. Now I have this NARS, I'm gonna get, Whenever I bought them, they were cruelty free. So I'm gonna keep for sure Cruella. Cruella is a beautiful red lipstick. It's probably one of the best ones. And I have Sex Machine. I don't know. What do you think? It's a beautiful. I hate, I'm gonna keep it. Whenever I bought it was whenever they were cruelty free. So I'm gonna keep it. We have two color pops. We have Deja, Deja, and Bambi, which is this one, Bambi. Oh, that's pretty. I should be wearing it more often. So I'm gonna keep it. If I don't use it the next couple months, I'm for sure gonna get rid of it. And De Deja, Deja, and you can see it. I'm gonna get rid of it. Uh, it's too light for me, so. And now I have uh, this Urban Decay black lipstick. This is the only black lipstick I own and I got it in a point reward. So I'm gonna keep it because it's the only one I have, so for sure. Now, MAC lipstick. This is a limited edition, so I'm gonna keep it. And this one, it's not limited, I mean it was, but it's not like a packaging. Though I love this color and I need to find a replacement. <laughs> that one. It's the best purple with a little bit of red and it's matte. So I'm gonna keep it with the purpose of finding a dupe and then I'll get rid of it. So I'm gonna keep it. Again, back to Tom Ford. I mean, they're 50 something dollar lipstick. So whenever I bought one, I was sure that I was gonna like the color. So I'm gonna keep it because it's too expensive and I don't see myself getting rid of it. Uh, this is new, so I'm gonna keep it. All right. I'm just gonna flip it. Oh my god, so much makeup. 
Um, wait on what? Ooh, is this one a dupe? For the Mac? Mm. On camera they look like, but not really in person. Uh, I'm not sure about this wet and well. I don't wear them that much. So, I'm gonna get rid of it because it's not even a dupe for the real one. So, I'm gonna get rid of it. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this um, lipstick from L'Oreal. I don't care anymore about L'Oreal. I have this NARS liner. Whenever I bought it, they were cruelty free and I like the colors, so I'm gonna keep it. All right. I'm just gonna try to grab a couple. They look about the same brand. Okay. So this is a Revlon. No, this is not, this is Rimmel. I'm gonna get rid of it. I mean, don't like the color, but I'm gonna get rid of it. I'm gonna get rid of it. Also another Rimmel, this is Bordeaux. Oh, I used to love this color whenever I was starting to make up because it's like a little lip gloss. Well, not lip gloss, but like a lip stain. Ugh. But. I'm gonna get rid of it. Vintage pink. This is like a color that my mom would wear, but um, it's old and it's not cruelty free, so I'm not gonna pass that along. Uh, I have this YSL lipstick which I used to love but I don't use it that much I had this NYX gloss butter I don't use it though I don't use it so I'm gonna get rid of it I have another Sharon Osborne uh, lip gloss like from the collection so I am gonna keep this one Getting rid of this Revlon. Uh, I know I saw another one. All right. I had this Blamplify lip glosses. These are really pigmented. Though they're from Mac, but I really like the color, so I'm gonna keep them. I have another Jouer liquid lipstick. This one is on Lychee. It's really good, so I recommend it. So I'm gonna keep that one. Now I have a couple of MAC lip glosses, which I'm gonna get rid of. I'm gonna get rid of, look at that one, it's beautiful, but... I'm already keeping other ones, even though I shouldn't. Uh, I have this NYX color, which I should keep it. I, don't, I need to wear it more often. It's called Lala. I love it. Um, it's this one. By the way, this one. <laughs> so I'm gonna keep it. These green lipsticks. This one is from Kylie uh, Cosmetics, which I like. I need to wear more often, so I'm gonna keep that one. And then I had this color pop, which I thought I was gonna wear more often as a um, eyeliner, which I haven't. But hopefully with this declutter, I'm going to be wearing it more often. If I don't wear it that more often, then I'll get rid of it. Now, we have this new Anastasia lipsticks, which I'm not going to get rid of. They are awesome. I want all of her lipsticks. I have another one. Uh, I have another two. Jeffree Star, which I love, so I'm gonna keep them. And I do wear them, honestly. Those are like, Jeffree Star like my go-to uh, liquid lipsticks. Mm, what is this? This is a lip liner from Verse, Bare Minerals. It's the only lip liner that I have that is kind of like for that color, so I am gonna keep it. And, oh, this is the matching lip liner for, like, the Kylie Cosmetics, so I am going to keep that one. Um, so this one is going to be sad to get rid of, but, I mean, come on, it's in a Ziploc bag. I thought I was going to buy a new cap or something, but 
I stepped on this lipstick and the cap broke and I thought I was gonna buy something uh, but it clearly never happened so it probably went even back quicker and it's in a Ziploc bag, come on Ali so I'm gonna get rid of it sadly, it's from the Rocky Horror Picture Show it's, I love it so it's kind of sad but it's time another uh, Anastasia lipsticks which I'm not getting rid of now, yeah, we were talking about Clover, and she's really pink, this color, so I'm never gonna wear it, too pink for me, so I'm gonna get rid of it. And then I have this primer, which I've never used, so I'm gonna put it in front of the drawer and hopefully I use it, if not, then I'll get rid of it after. Uh, I have this glossy lip paint from the chart, a little sample, uh, I'm gonna keep, there, keep it. Now, we have a couple Tom Ford lipsticks here, which you already know how I feel about this lipstick, so I'm gonna keep that. Uh, I have a Milani lipstick. This one, I don't even know what color it is, it doesn't even say. Oh, Enchanted Ruby. I think this was from a limited collection, but I, I like those uh, matte lipsticks, so I'm gonna keep it. I also like this matte lipstick from um, Wet n Wild called Nightcap. So that's a keeper. Oh, I think it keeps falling. I'm gonna keep this packaging though. It's come on, the Rocky Horror Picture Show. I know it's empty, but I'm gonna keep it. Uh, I have a couple of um, MAC lipsticks here. I stripped me down, notice me, and hoop. I told myself I would be only keeping limited edition packaging. So I'm gonna get rid of them. <sighs> I have this NARS Scarlet Empress. Empress. Uh, I love this color and whenever but it was cruelty free, so I'm gonna keep it. Here's the a bite beauty um called Cure Royale. I think this one I got it on an extra point. But you already know how I feel about lip glosses, so I'm gonna get rid of it. Another nice lipsticks. I might get rid of this pink one though. I don't even know you can tell. It's too pink for me, so I'm gonna get rid of it. But I'm gonna keep the other one. Uh, I had this honey infused lip gloss from Too Faced, which I'm gonna keep. Cause come on, honey. Even though I don't wear lip gloss that much, but I haven't kept much lip glosses, so I think I'm okay. Uh, I had this Ciate lipstick that came with the uh, Chloe Morello palette, the first one, so I'm gonna keep it. Here is Gemini from Jeffree Star, so let's put it back in its box. And it's obvious I'm gonna keep it. Uh, this is a Guerlain lipstick kind of uh, lip balm. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of it, even though it was expensive, but. I kept a lot of non cruelty free makeup already, so I'm gonna get rid of this one. Um, I had these, I think, was this a perk? I don't know, but this is like a smaller size NARS lipstick. It is pretty, but I never wear it, so I'm gonna get rid of it. Uh, this NYX. Yeah, I'm running out of space. It's pretty though. I might keep, this is a maybe, I'm gonna put it in the maybe pile. Uh, I have a tiny, tiny bite beauty uh, lipstick, which I don't know, it's too small, so I think I'm gonna get rid of it. For some reason they always like fall in my drawer and I never see them. What, I had two of the same color. Yeah, so I'm gonna get rid of this. <laughs> Uh, I have this MAC lips, um, kind of like a lipstick, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna keep this one. I'll just use it up and get rid of it. I'm almost, um, this one was limited edition, so I'm gonna keep it and just finish it. Uh, I have this Box and Dolly, 
which I should use more often. So I'm going to keep it. If I don't use it in the next couple months, I'm going to get rid of it. Now we have Lumiere from Colourpop. Of course, I'm going to keep it. It has such a beautiful color. Uh, this is Kiss Chase, but Charlotte Tilbury, you'll see I have a lot of Charlotte Tilbury. They're my favorite, like, lipsticks. So for sure, I'm going to keep those. And I have this Melted Matte, um, it's not Melted Matte, Melted Chocolate Liquid Lipstick um, from Too Faced. This is probably the only one full size that I own and I should wear it more often so I'm going to keep it. And I have Beetroot from By Beauty which I love Beetroot. Uh, it's like a red purple, really nice. And then this is Kiss Kiss Bang Bang by Marc Jacobs. Is that one, that pink one right here in the middle. So I do like his mini lipstick, so I'm going to keep them. I actually have uh, the new set now that we're talking about what to keep. So of course I'm going to keep this one. I'm going to keep those. Plus I, the other ones are in my everyday makeup bag. So I'm going to, I don't know how I'm going to keep, I don't know what to do with this thing. If you have any ideas what to do, let me know. But I'm going to keep the lipstick. I'm going to keep also this Kiss Bang Bang. This one is from... I don't know how I got it, but uh, this is not from that set, though. This is my last lipsticks. So you already know I'm going to keep my set of uh, Charlotte Tilbury. That's already known. And let's put this Charlotte Tilbury. This is Pillow Talk, Penelope Pink, and Between the Sheets. I'm going to keep all of them. I have a lot of here that are non-cruelty free, so we'll see how it goes. All right, tone four, you already know. I'm gonna keep them. And I'm gonna keep this Chanel because it brings me memories of like one of my first lipsticks also, like first luxury products. I mean, come on, it opens that way. Even though I don't use it, I just wanna keep it just to have it <laughs> on my collection. Uh, so let's get that out of the way. Um, we already kept one of these YSL lipsticks, so I'm going to get rid of these two. It hurts, but I'm going to get rid of it. Now I have this Urban Decay Shame lipstick, which I love the color and I need to wear it more often, so I'm going to keep that one. This one is Mia Walla. This was from uh, Pulp Fiction collection, so I'm for sure going to keep it. Another nurse, full frontal. One of the first lipsticks I also I ever bought when I was getting into makeup. So this is a keeper. I'm gonna get rid of this YSL as well. Cabon D keeper, even though it's a little bit shiny, but I still like it. Uh this is sample from the Melted Liquid Lipsticks from Too Faced, which I'm going to keep. And now I'm just getting rid of all ev everything that way is just MAC. So uh, this is Miss Kenningston from Charlotte Tilbury, which I absolutely love this lipstick. Calvin Klein. Do you guys know if Calvin Klein... I mean, do they still even have makeup or not anymore? I'm going to keep it just... For a dupe, I mean, I really like this lipstick, so I'm going to see if I can find a dupe. If not, then I'll... Now, we have these MAC lipsticks, which I feel so bad of getting rid of. But, alright, just by looking at the colors, I had to be, and I feel I'm going to allow myself to just get two. Among the fireflies, and hopefully, I can get a dupe of this one because I absolutely love this color. I'm gonna keep that one, and from this color, I'm gonna keep Rare Breed. I hope I'm fine a dupe for this one. 
Besides on that, I didn't see anything that I possibly need a dupe. So I'm gonna go ahead and say bye to Mac. I seriously, I'm not kidding you, I wanna cry. I just wanna cry. Oh my God. All right, let's just move on, let's keep going. Uh, these are our maybe pile. I'm gonna get rid of Tootsie. I have so much lipsticks, I, I don't want it. I'm gonna keep this box on one, because I didn't keep that many lip glosses. Just by looking at the keep file, I still have a lot of lipsticks, so I'm gonna get rid of this NYX one. And I'm gonna get rid of this one, because honestly, I don't use them. They're beautiful, but I don't use them and they're all, honestly. So, here it is, what I'm getting rid of. That one, and all of these ones. So, I think that's quite a bit. I think it will be good. And then, this is the key file. Alright, so this is it. I, I think I did good. I mean, I, I get rid of this. And I'm keeping these little sets. I mean, they're not little. <laughs> these sets. So it's about half of it, half of my collection, which I'm pretty happy about. Hi, so we're back. Um, I already put all my lipsticks back into the drawer. I actually went up uh, a couple of them and now I'm using this smaller size, the uh, thinner, thinner size, I guess. Let's take a look. So this is what it looks like now. Way better. Now I can actually see everything that I have. Um, I put it in these like vanity impressions. I like acrylic holder that I found on home goods. Now all my lipsticks are pretty much here. And then I have a couple long ones that didn't fit now in my shorter drawer. And I have now my lip, my package there. And the Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks, since it's in a set, I actually have it on my dresser. So that one won't be here. But I think I did pretty good. Maybe more than half, I don't know. Uh, I'm pretty happy with this declutter. I hope you guys like it too. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!